Thank you for watching this video, Demand Response Exchange. I am Rafael Hertzberg, an energy consultant based in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Our agenda will cover the power bill charges, a new concept for a century-old challenge, why it is a win-win situation, the proposed service, teaming up to make it happen. The power bill received by industrial, commercial and institutional energy users, they include two charges. The kilowatt demand charges, known also as wire fees, which account for, roughly speaking, 20% of the monthly power bill. And the kilowatt hour energy charges, known also as commodity, is responsible for the balance of the 80% of the charges. There are two basic methods for distribution companies to charge kilowatt demand around the globe. The first one is the maximum monthly demand. It means that the local distribution company records the monthly demand, compares it with the contracted demand, and if the contracted is below the recorded, there is a penalty that should be paid by the end user. The ratchet system is very similar. The local distribution company records the monthly demand and compares it with the maximum past 11 months demand. And the build demand is the maximum between the recorded monthly demand and the maximum value of the past 11 month demand. The real life situation is about changes. The industrial sector, for example, it's about technology changes when it comes to production, energy efficiency, products mix, market demand. The commercial sector may be about occupation in that specific building that may change from time to time. Energy efficiency may play an important role. And of course, behavior when it comes to energy management may be an important factor. And here comes the huge challenge. The business environment is always changing, but the demand charge, it's not flexible at all. The demand challenge is not really very well recognized around the globe. If the contracted demand is too high, it means that an idle demand payment is there on a monthly basis. If the contracted demand is too low, a penalty payment may be there. So it, it is a very tricky situation. For the power distribution companies, it makes all the sense, this billing method. Basically, because we are talking about infrastructure-related investments. It's basically capital intensive. And at the end of the day, the capacity that was contracted by the end user is available right there for the client. And accordingly, it must be compensated. The proposed service, Demand Response Exchange, is a very simple concept. The distribution company will remain with the same overall contracted demand before and after the proposed transactions. Clients of that given distribution company might exchange their demand differences. So clients will reduce their power bill when it comes to the demand charges. And the distribution companies will be able to postpone infrastructure related investments because idle demands will be exchanged and become active demands. The distribution companies will increase their energy sales with the same infrastructure. This is a real case example that actually stimulated me to create this demand exchange service. This 
distribution company had clients A and B at their system and it happened that both clients were right next door neighbors and separately they contracted me as their energy consultant. So one, an industrial plant A was willing to reduce its, its contracted demand because it was paying for 200 kilowatts idle demands. And on the other hand, the shopping mall was willing to increase 200 kilowatts, the contracted demand, because they were paying penalties for surpassing the contracted demand. So the local utility company told me the following story. They would not be in a position to increase the contracted demand for the client B because the system was already operating at its uh, nominal capacity. And for client A, the, the problem was that if they wanted to reduce the contracted demand, they would have to, to uh, sign a, a letter requesting this uh, reduction. And accordingly to the regulations, they would have to wait for a full year before the contracted demand was um, reduced to the requested value. So it would take a long time and both clients A and B uh, were really very sad with the outcome. So the demand exchange addresses this challenge. The demand response exchange is an internet-based service sponsored by the local distribution company. All clients willing to reduce their contracted demands would post their idle demands there at, the, at this specific website. All other clients that were interested in increasing their contracted demands would be in a position, position to capture these idle demands. So when that happens, a and B exchange their demand differences. And then the local distribution company formalizes the new demands. It is a zero sum game in terms of contracted demands. This concept is aligned with what is already happening in the developed countries. Let me give you one very interesting example of a local distribution company that is offering special rates for off-peak water heating service. It means that customers that are willing to save money, they allow the local distribution company to remotely shut their water heaters off at critical times. So it means that they would be in a position to get a very hefty compensation and the local distribution company would be in a position to uh, survive with the same infrastructure. The demand response exchange value can be calculated in rough numbers here. Let's say we are talking about a medium sized 10 gigawatt power distribution company. Let's say also that using this demand response exchange, this distribution company may be in a position to offer 5% of additional energy supply with the same infrastructure. We are talking about postponing capital expenditures of about $500 million. If you would like to consider the development of this demand response exchange, here goes my contact information, email, mobile, WhatsApp. And if you click on the energy consultant link, you will get more information about my um, bio. Thank you very much and I am looking forward to hearing from you.